There's only one thing to do. Drop it. Ba 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 I'm loving it. Hey guys, it's Robotnik and Sexy, and uh, I just couldn't resist playing more with this McDonald's theme team. Uh, I just, I don't know, it's, it's just the ridiculous of it, the ridiculousness of all of it is just too, too much. Uh, but anyway, I'm gonna lead off with Scarf Golduck, also known as Birdie, the early Birdie, who goes and gets those McDonald's early times breakfasts, and they taste like shit, and then she is stuck in the bathroom, taking the shits all day. Uh, so I'm gonna make a kind of an obvious play, go for Hydro Pump, but I didn't really want to think about it, um, and it's really not the end of the world, as I can switch into Ron- well, I could bait him to go for the Psychic by switching into Muck, and then switching out- but he just goes for Leech Seed, but I can kill him off with the, uh, with the Ghost Ball, also known as Shadow Ball, but unfortunately that leaves him a very wide opportunity, a big window to take out Ronald McDonald with Scum Tank, because Scum Tank says no to Psychic and Ghosts in menu. It's actually really good, so... Uh, I've weakened him with some sort of attack. I'm switching into Grimace now, going for the unprotected Focus Punch as he switches out into Murkrow. And Murkrow's gonna take that pretty well, but, um, not that well. And I know, I know, ladies and gentlemen, that, um, if I go for a poison jab, and if I get lucky enough to poison, which I do, he's gonna have no choice but to roost. And, uh, yeah, that's what he's gonna do. And, yeah, we're gonna go for that unprotected focus punch. Bam! Wham, bam, thank you, Mr. Murkrow, out of there. And that is one huge headache out of the game. Uh, I really, really despise facing Murkrow in NU because he's really bulky, and he did look like the Parish Trapping set, but um, uh, I actually dislike the um, other one more, where it just kind of dicks with you with like Thunderwave and Swagger. But uh, anyway, uh, some shit is happening. Fright Kids is going to giggity drain, take out that Skun Tank, uh, which is great. Skun Tank is a really, really strong Pokemon, stronger than well, you know. You, you know, when you first get into NU, you wouldn't really think Scum Tank would be, like, OP and really good, but he is. He's really, really good, so... I'm gonna Sleep Powder whatever. He, um, switches into, um, Reggie... Reggie from Nintendo, and, um... I'm gonna Leech Seed. I'm gonna spread my Leech Seed everywhere. Just shoot my seed everywhere, and I'm gonna miss, but I'm gonna go for it again, because I've, I've got enough to go, and I, I land it this time, which is good. So, um, yeah... Uh, I'm getting healed a lot with the Giga Drain and Leech Seed, and it's a pretty opportune time to switch out, because he is kind of screwed here, and I know Cosmic, or, yeah, I'll call him, that's, I think that's how you say it, Cosmic, I know he can take a hit, um, um, that might be Specs, looking at that damage, uh, maybe, I mean, he keeps going for the same move, he's not taking Life Orb, and it's doing a hefty chunk to Shuckle, who has immense special defense, I have it maxed out with, uh, Calm Nature, too, so... Probably Specs, and he's just gonna leave it in and go for the deep punch with the Golurk. But, uh, what, what happens if I hit myself? Um, yeah, I must, and, uh, yeah, he's just gonna finish me with another deep punch, which is fine. I got up my Stealth Rocks, and that's all that really matters, even though they're incredible late game Stealth Rocks that probably aren't needed. But, uh, Birdie is still pretty healthy, so I can just go uh, for the uh, Risky Hydro Pump. Luckily, I do land it uh, twice, actually, so that's cool. Regigigas can take it like a boss, though, because it has that big HP investment, but Poison is actually going to take me out at the end of my turn and give me a free switch into Grimace, which is actually really great. And yeah, you know what it is. Unprotected Focus Punch. Yeah. Wham bam. Right there. So beautiful. So, so beautiful. To me, Grimace, you pile of slime. I just, I, I, yeah, he's just good. Uh, we're gonna segue into a UU battle now. Um, I'm using Jack's team. Uh, pretty much, unless I use Hailstall or Jack's team, I um, get curb stomped. Honestly, UU is 
definitely my worst tier. Uh, maybe Uber is worse, though. Um, I seem to have lost my 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 uh, chops in Uber. I think I just need to make my team more uh, more good, uh, but I don't care to do that. So I keep using the bad team, and then I get destroyed. But anyway, uh, let's get to the this this match that is happening. Um, I'm using Dragon Tail. He will wisp to Grounder, which is a little unfortunate, but getting up Stealth Rocks and phasing is. The main prerogative of uh, that Rhyperior set and taking special hits. Didn't take the Giga Drain too well though, but because he doesn't have a Raikou on his team or anything, it's not that big of a deal. Kafagus is going to take a, a Flare Blitz not well. He's going to switch into it actually, which allows me to just go for another one for free, and that is going to be the end of Kofagrigus. Really glad that there was not a Chansey on this team. Um, but, uh, anyway, uh, I'm also really glad that he's gonna stay in as I go for the HP ice. I guess he didn't see it coming because, because, I don't know why, maybe he sucks? Maybe he's bad? Maybe, I don't know, I mean, I would assume most Zeptos carry HP ice. Uh, anyway, j the one that Jack designed does, so that's gonna be handy. I'm just gonna stay in and go for Thunderbolts, because Glade is that natural special bulk. It can take a couple, but, uh, Sanic! Just gonna finish it off with an HP ice. Should it want to, should he want to switch out into anything else? Uh, save it as death fodder, but he doesn't, which is good. Um, that crowbat is looking at like choice band damage. It's gonna a uh, surprisingly two shot uh, slow um, bro. He is the bro of the slow, and a scarf Daku once again is gonna save the day really. And uh, I thought the game was over. I thought Yanmega might outspeed me after this and just sweep me because the rest of my guys do not want to take Yanmega hits, but it so turns out that Jolly Max Speed's Scarf Darmanitan is so OP as shit that he can outspeed a plus one speed uh, Yanmega. He m was probably modest and, uh, I don't know, he just can, so he can just finish off the game. So basically, that match is called Darmanitan Kicks Ass. and. Uh, Speaking of fire Pokemon, we're gonna segue into the third and final match. We're gonna go. We're gonna go for this. This is a really good match. This is um has fire Pokemon, as you can see. He's got a Charizard. He's got a Flareon, and that is definitely a Sun team. Um, yeah, Sun. Yeah, I don't know if Ronald McDonald team can really take on Sun well at all. Um, I'm just gonna let you know uh, it can't at all. A sun just completely overpowers me, and there's not really much I can do about it. Um, uh, yeah, I was hoping he would go for growths, but he's too smart for that, and he's just going to attack, which is bad. Um, so I've got to stall out his turns of sun, and to do that, I'm going to have to sacrifice Muck and the Hamburglar, or um, Grimace, I should say, but... Um, that allows me to get a free switch into Scarf Gold Duck, also known as Birdie, and finish off uh, that Victor Bell, which is a huge problem Pokemon. And Volbeat's just gonna come right in, get up that sun, get up that tail glow. I don't know why I haven't thought about using Volbeat myself for Sunny Day, but um, I, I do like using Unpheasant a lot because it does have surprise value, because just on, on first glance, my sun and you team just looks like a regular and you team. So I don't think people expect it from Unpheasant, so... I don't know. And I just like using Unpheasant. 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 So, he's gonna miss uh, Fire Blast there, which is probably the biggest turn of the match. That is gonna give me some hope, um, because that Fire Blast would have definitely done like 200% of my health or something. I mean, he had a tail glow under his belt, and the sun is up, he had solar power. Yeah, I mean, but you know, Sunday Day is in a... Blech. It is an inaccurate move, so... Yeah, that's just what happens. It's happened to me as well, so... Um, but, I don't know, whenever I play PS, I seem to dodge um, Fire Blast skillfully quite a bit. Um, but, uh, yeah, he's gonna pass a Tail Glow to Sawsbuck. That had me really paranoid. I thought it was, like, a, some weird-ass special attack spec Sawsbuck or something. But he's just Life Orb, which means that um, I can take him out with a combination of uh, Hidden Power Fighting and uh, Tangela being a boss sauce, and uh, he's, he's left to uh, Volbeat and Regirock, and I can pretty much take those guys anytime I want, so he knows this, and he's gonna forfeit, but yeah, man, if you're watching this, you definitely deserve that match, because that Fire Blast would have just destroyed my team, because Gold 
duck, also known as Birdie, was the only real thing keeping me in there. But yeah, offensive Sun and Enyu is quite, quite good. So, yeah, those are going to be my three videos, YouTube. If you liked them, leave a like rating if you want, or leave a comment, because it would make me super, super sus. But uh, yeah, that's going to be it. I'll see you later, YouTube.